Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Hey Legends Nexus fans, welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into a fascinating story about Riot Games and their hit animated series Arcane. If you've been keeping up with the latest news and updates, you might have heard that there's been some controversy surrounding Arcane's massive budget, specifically, how much it costs to produce those 18 episodes. According to reports, Arcane's whopping $250 million budget is not only a record-breaker, but also sparked heated debates among fans and industry experts. Now, we know what you're thinking. How did Riot Games manage to blow such a big hole in their wallet? Well, let's dig into the details. One of the key points to note here is that Mark Merrill, co-founder and chief product officer at Riot Games, has come forward to set the record straight. In a recent post on Reddit, Merrill shared some insight into how Arcane was always planned to be a two-season show from the very beginning. He even revealed that there was an internal budget conversation about approving five seasons, which is where the confusion seems to have originated. But what really caught our attention was when Merrill addressed the massive budget head-on. He pointed out that while it's true Arcane costs significantly less per minute compared to traditional animated films like Pixar, the market for high-quality adult animation just didn't exist before Arcane came along. So, Hollywood is still trying to wrap its head around why Riot Games would choose to invest so heavily in something that deviates from the norm. Now, Merrill also took a moment to address some of the concerns about the development budget being too high. He explained that most of the budget goes directly to talented individuals such as animators, voice actors, and concept artists essentially prioritizing art over other aspects. This is a bold move by Riot Games, but one that's been praised by many in the animation community. Interestingly, there was another tidbit revealed about Arcane's production process. Merrill shared that character animation alone makes up around 80% of the budget, with every frame hand-animated to achieve that level of quality. Talk about attention to detail! As for what's next for League of Legends animations, it seems like Christian Linke and the team are already cooking up some new ideas set in Runeterra. Mark Merrill confirmed this, but also emphasized how challenging it is to create high-quality content from scratch, especially when it comes to storytelling and world-building. And there you have it, folks. The story of Arcane's massive budget in all its glory. Whether you're a fan of the show or just interested in the behind-the-scenes process, one thing's for sure, Riot Games is pushing the boundaries of what's possible with animation, and we can't wait to see what they come up with next. Thanks for tuning in to Legends Nexus.